What's up guys and welcome to my channel Flame Over 4 and this issue 49 from Builder Terminator T800 we are going to be adding the details to the pelvis. I cannot wait to do it with you guys. We've got our pieces here. We're just going to quickly take them out of the box. Uh, what is it? We can call it a plastic container if not. Um, and once we've done that we're just going to run through what we should have and then we're going to start building. Okay guys, in this one we haven't got too many pieces. We have 49-1 which is the pelvic shield left, which we have just here. 49-2 uh, which is the pelvic plate, um, which is going to be this little piece here. Uh, we also have 49-3 which is the two pelvic sockets, which are going to be just them ones just there. And then we also have 49-4s which are 5mm screws. And there are three of those, so you can't get those wrong. Right, so what we're going to do is we're just going to turn the magazine over and see what it wants us to do. Um, before we proceed, it's not asking us to do this first, but actually we will do what it asks us to do, which wants us to glue um, this onto this section. So this is from issue 48, the last issue we did. Again, if you want to, I didn't do it on the last one, test fit to make sure that it clicks into place, which it does absolutely fine. Once you're happy with it, go get your trusty super glue and you just need to put it on these two little tabs which are here. So just put a little bit on that tab there and then a little bit on this tab here. And then you can just piece this together um, so that it stays into place. And that should slot in really nicely, which as you can see, it goes together really well. It doesn't really take too much piecing together to get it into place. Um, there you go. So once you're happy with it, you should have something that looks like this. While that's drying, we're just going to pop that out of the way. You need to take out these little tabs. So it says cut the two sockets 49-3 from the frame and smooth the surface of the cutting points if necessary. Take care when using the crafting knife. So as you know, I just use a Stanley blade. Um, please use a crafting knife and be careful when doing this. This is why this is mainly um, an adult um, build because um, children uh, should be supervised if they're doing it and you know and not using the standing light so there you go right so that's that done and the tabs done here so just need to take that tiny little bit of tab off so it's only just to get enough the last little bit of residue that comes off when you peel these off the tabs so there you go so once that's done it's asking us the next thing it's saying for us to do is to take this frame so fit the socket 49-3 which are these little sockets here, and then it's asking us to fit those into the pelvic shields 48-2 and 49-1. Note that there is a bar on the underside of each socket that fits into the slot in the recess in the shields. So you want to make sure that these are upside down and they're going to fit into the recess into the shield. So what that does is that just means that it pushes into there like so, and then that one will sit into there like so. So there you go, so that's how that should look. I will just bring it closer and just show you that again. So they just sit inside there, just like that. Right, so the next thing it's asking us to do is to just secure it into place. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna go ahead and do that now. So we only have those screws, so you can't really get it wrong. So we're gonna pop these screws into there to hold that into place. So just make sure that it goes in nice and level. I probably just do this in real time and not even speed it up guys because it's just such a small um, thing to do. It's not going to take long. Don't over tighten them. I'm just going to pop the next one in just down into here. I'm, I'm really liking how this is all coming together. I really am. So that's just going to go down into there. As I said, don't over tighten it. Just do it enough so that they don't move. And then that's where they go. So the screws are now into there and then into that section there as well. And then that is the pelvis frame coming together really nicely. This bottom section here is gonna be where we put the bottom pelvis. So step five, on either side of the front of the pelvis, there is a recess that follow the curve of the pelvis. After test fitting, apply a little super glue around the edges. So what it wants us to do, it wants this section here to just go into there. It wants you to test fit it, but look how good it goes together. It just fits together so nicely. It doesn't really need test fitting. We need to super glue that in. So what we're gonna do now is we're just gonna take our trusty super glue here. We're gonna put a nice even amount of um, super glue around the edge. And then we're just gonna do the same on the other side. 
Try not to get too carried away if you can. And then this is just going to fit over the top of that, push into place, and then we'll wait for that super glue to set. And then that is what it should look like at the end of this stage. Isn't that looking absolutely fantastic? There you go. So we'll just pop that down, put the lid back on the super glue so I don't get my hand stuck to it later on in time. Uh, we have one spare screw. I kind of don't have these in order. I just have a bag full of screws. Um, you don't get many over in the Terminator issues. Um, I'm just going to read through the magazine. Not going to spoil it for you. I'm just going to just go through. It's asking you. It's telling you how to stick that on. You don't really need to know how to stick that on. It's just done like that. Um, it's going. We're going to go through the magazine just real quick. Have a look at a couple of bits in here. Um, the current state of the VR um, and then in the next issues um, so we're going to be doing issue so we're just on issue 49 we're going to be doing issue 50 in issue 50 we're going to fit the pelvis to the spine so I cannot wait to do that guys which means we're going to probably run out of space um, on here but we're going to try and show you as much detail as we can but there you go so we're going to be fitting the pelvis to the spine please join me again in issue 50 where we're going to be doing that please like share and subscribe and I'll see you on the next one take care now Bye-bye.